today we're going to be doing a brief demonstration on how to maximize your damage and healing as Baptiste, particularly the rhythms and patterns I would like to see you guys try to implement for shooting and healing in your games. So we'll just get right into it. Uh, first one, you know, very early in the fight, our team isn't really taking any damage at all. Uh, we'll ignore the bot's HP right now. But, but you know, uh, very early on in the fight, I'm just going to shoot. That one's a no-brainer. Next one, you know, uh, our team's taking a little bit of poke, a tiny bit of damage, nothing serious though. Uh, what we're going to be looking to do just to get a bunch of damage in, but also, you know, keep them topped off. Also keep charging our ultimate as well, is we're going to shoot, shoot, heal. Shoot, shoot, heal. Uh, you can even get three shots in if you want. Uh, this one is really good, as I said. Uh, you're getting a bunch of damage in. You're also keeping your team topped off, uh, cleaning up the poke, and charging up your ultimate a good amount. Now, next one, you know, your team is taking a good amount of damage. We want to maximize our healing per second while also getting some damage in. We are going to shoot, heal, shoot, heal, shoot, heal, shoot, heal. This one is a little bit more mechanically demanding, you know, because you are going to have to go back and forth between the targets. Uh, but as I said, it does maximize your healing output while getting damage in. As if you check here, you see this little delay between our healing shots. During that delay, we're able to get a shot in. Uh, so yeah. And then the last one, you know, our team is taking tons of pressure. We don't even want to risk looking away from them. We're just going to consistently heal. But at that point, you know, you're probably going to want to use your regen, maybe your immortality field. Hell, you could even throw up window for yourself. That is a valid strategy as it does double your healing output as well as your damage. Uh, but yeah, uh, these are the things I want you thinking about as a support player, especially as Baptiste, of course. Uh, any support, Ana, Kiriko, it's, it's very similar. Uh, the big thing we want to do while getting our damage in is we do not want to tunnel vision. We want to be paying attention to our team analyzing how much damage they're taking and implementing the right pattern based on that. So yeah, uh, that's all I have for now. The reason I wanted to show this is because the next VOD we're going to be looking at is uh, Ultimate. He's the same Bap Kiriko player that we looked at the other day. Uh, I just wanted to do a just a brief demonstration on what I'd like to see you guys doing because I will be referencing this video in that VOD. But yeah, uh, that's all I have for now, as I said. Uh, let me know if you have any questions, comments, anything like that, and best of luck in your climb.